<laughs> Another Saturday night, she sits amidst a den in far too familiar surroundings. Our place, made stale by routine, half dozen nearly empty glasses arranged between them. He taps his cell phone, its bluish glow highlighting his elongated fingers, still so sensual to her sight. What do you want to do tomorrow, he inquires languidly, by browsing notifications. She pauses, the lip of her glass barely grazing her own, studying his distant expression, realizing this will be the final evening she allows those seductive hands to search out her most primal pleasures. He replaces his phone. She licks salt from the rim of her cocktail. Thanks. Erosion. As he paces over the pebbles, smooth stones along the shore, he spies a bit of blue lace stuck on some battered driftwood marooned ashore, quivering in a breeze full of troubled memories where true words were left unsaid, replaced by trivial grievances, bitter rebukes unworthy of a spring twilight. These petty complaints remain hanging in the air far longer than is fair, so that even after she has departed, his surroundings remain poisoned only gradually do the tides begin their work of wearing away the rough edges, eroding the hurts of the past so that they may injure less in the future, dissolving those words and phrases now so regretted, now so longing to be reclaimed into that gentle wind, which causes a simple piece of lace to dance with such complexity. Thank you.